Questions about Loudoun County judges' behavior. Circuit Court Judge James Fisher is already under fire for throwing a woman in jail for alleged contempt, even as she was testifying that her former boyfriend had punched her in the face twice. Now we're talking to a lawyer who says that same judge blew up and threw her in jail too. This is a Bruce Lachan story, and it is a story you'll only see here on WUSA 9, and we have to warn you, some of what you're about to hear is graphic. Circuit Court for Loudoun County is now in session. The Honorable James P. Fisher presiding. Closed circuit video takes you right inside the Loudoun courtroom on New Year's Eve 2020. I need You're the justification for the record. I've given you justification. Sterling divorce lawyer Rachel Verk was asking for an explanation after Judge James Fisher ruled against her client on a motion. I'm not clear what that is. Under 103, well, is that what you're saying? Well, let me make something clear. If you keep arguing with me, you're going to be held in contempt. Is that clear? Judge Fisher exploded. I don't know your honor's ruling. You're held in contempt, ma'am. Take custody of Mrs. Verk. Step her back. I impose a penalty of $250 and one night in the county jail. This matter is adjourned. All rise. The judge left the bench and the sheriff's deputy took her into custody. That was considered contemptuous enough for me to be shackled, chained, subjected to a strip search and thrown in jail for the night. You're a lawyer in court representing your client, and the judge orders you shackled and sent to jail? You have to strip naked, stand in front of a deputy. If you're a woman, lift up your breasts, turn around, bend over, spread your butt cheeks. I think this guy may have a problem with women. Protesters have already been calling for the Virginia General Assembly to impeach Judge Fisher after he did much the same thing earlier this month to a woman testifying against her former partner in a domestic violence case. Uh, Me? I'm going to sentence you to 10 days in the county jail. I'm going to remand you to the custody. Me? Um, what? Um, <laughs> I don't even, I don't even know. What is that? That resonated with me. <laughs> like, what? just happened. Verg complained to the Judicial Review Commission, but it is not clear what action it took. She is also suing the sheriff and the clerk of courts, alleging negligence and false imprisonment. As for Judge Fisher, he is on the bench, but declining to talk to reporters. Bruce Lasham, WUSA 9.